Hello, 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 and welcome back to Lakeside Roleplay. We're hopping in here with the Liberty County Sheriff's Office, and we're going to be hopping in with this new, newly introduced 2020 Explorer that I made for the uh, Sheriff's Office. So let's go ahead and uh, get into it. Um, I'll explain a little bit more into the car itself and how good it looks and why it looks so good, in my opinion. And... Uh, how intimidated I feel being behind the wheel. I feel like I stole a police car. IRL. So, yeah, hope you guys enjoy it and let's get into it. So, this car freaking hauls too, and I love it because this is exactly how they drive IRL. They do 80 on the highway, and I can actually do 80 because it's only five over in game. and uh, everything like that. So this is based off of the... Oh, that would have been a good spot, actually. Hang on. All right, so just to show you this car a little bit. Let's go ahead and go in first person. So we got Liberty County Sheriff. Get the badge. It looks much better IRL. Traffic. Everything like that. Emergency 911. SL110. Looks so good. Hey, buggy car. Go ahead, Looks so Wet down, good. Road, so the other Explorer that's um, currently in, that's new, is uh, the one that the sheriff's driving right now. And I think I just saw it. Hang on. Let's see. No, I didn't. All right, we're going to see if we can't find him. But I did a little montage before session, so I'll show that right about now. Hey kid, don't ever let them get inside your head. They'll tell you what to do in life instead of everything you know that you could get. Don't let them guide your life towards regret. I'll fight for what I love with every breath. My past is filled with things I won't forget I use them all to push me to my best So treat the worst of times just like a test If only I could go back in time I'd tell myself that everything will end up alright Just push yourself, test yourself, figure out what you like And find your limits, don't be rigid, always work towards a prime Surround yourself with open minds, people can change your life A few friends with intent can help you feel alive Find a passion, take some action, and with a little time Just be patient, make a statement, try to enjoy your life They'll try to kick you while you're down they wanna rise up while you drown They wanna fill your head with doubt They're silently scared that you'll figure it out I'll make it look like I'm losing Won't bother hiding my bruises And when they finally think you're wounded Then it's your chance to be ruthless Alright, so after that montage, um... We'll try to see if we can not get up to him. It's based on his IRL county so that'd be cool everything like that and uh now i'm just so happy that this is in game we got some red and blue lights um i rather use all blues but sheriff's office is red and blues in game you redid the patterns to make it look a little bit better and i really it's it's much better than it was before you know we'll hop out see the park and we got Standard wig wags and then front is pretty much pretty basic and I like it. I actually really do. It's really close to uh, IRL. I don't have a video or anything, but when they're behind you responding to three, you know, you kind of uh, figure out real quick that that's a sure city. So, yeah, yeah. Six hundred. Go ahead. I think it's 32 out here. Uh, there's gonna be the same vehicle southbound 55, close to 905. I got the uh, subject driving all over the highway, all in an uncommon lane. Roger, Sheriff's Office, Liberty County. As of now, he stopped on the right lane, um, southbound lanes. 
Hey, buddy. This is a nice spot, actually. Hey, Sheriff, what's up? Roger, control the 110. Oh, God. Uh, bye bye. 110. Could you backstate? It's going to be on a traffic stop, 905, Highway 55, southbound. 10 4, that was 905. Actually, I got the people. Levi's vehicle is, is still going. It's going eastbound to Maple Street now. I got the vehicle stopped. 1113 Maple Street. One town is out of that. One dispatch. 10211. Traffic He's slow taking off again. Highway 55 five South. 905. Roger. He's not in there. So it's interesting. So he keeps going, taking off, keeps going, taking off. Looks like I think we have a final stop now. 1107 Eastbound Maple. Received. 1107. Hey, what have we got? What's going on? Um, so I just recently pulled him over back on Spring Creek for the headlights. I released him with a warning. He's going back on the highway. Going south on the highway. I looked over, he was all on northbound lane. So when all of a sudden, uh, he was driving slow, maybe like 20, 30 miles an hour. And then occasionally he'll stop, kind of like teasing me that he was uh, going to have his final stop. He did that for about like two, three times now, and here we are here. All right. Cool. Yes, sir. I already got his, I already read his name and everything. Uh, he was arrested about a month ago by police chief. Or assault and felony evasion of law enforcement. All right, so he's a registered felon. Cool. Yeah. So if you want to talk to him and get what's going on. I mean, it's your stop. I don't know what you pulled him over for. So. The reckless driver. Oh, okay. Uh, come on, Peter. Why so, you, why we uh driving on oncoming lanes on the highway? Uh, I don't got an excuse for that. So we we just driving recklessly for no reason? Yeah, for IG reels. Control out of Gotta get my following up. For oh, so you doing this for social media? Oh yeah. It's probably not wise. You think? Don't you think? Yeah, it's not wise, but I need to get my followers up. Tough times. I'm poor. I hear you, but better things to do in your life than going 30 miles an hour in the oncoming lanes on a highway. You know, oh. don't you don't you see the safety risk of that? Oh yeah, I do. All right, sit tight, Peter. All right, so his reasoning was basically because he wanted to. He's doing it for social media views. Okay. Um, what was the reckless driving you witnessed? Oncoming lanes. That's about it. Okay. Like in and out of oncoming lanes or just straight up oncoming lanes for no reason? In and out. He did it twice. Okay. Then he was going Fine. about 30 miles an hour and 75. All right. Is he slurring his speech? Is it any bloodshot eyes, anything like that? Uh, slurred his speech, no. Okay. I don't know about the eyes. All right. Hey, go ahead and shut off our car for us. Hey, keep, keep the call off, Peter. 
I want some air. Alright. Sir, have you had anything to drink tonight? Um... I plead a fifth. Okay. So, would you be willing to submit to some field sobriety tests? I don't want to. You do or don't want to, sir? No, I don't. Okay. Control back again. Alright. Hey, I'm gonna go check a couple things real quick and I'll be right back. Okay. So, they can't hear me right now, but I'm just gonna check to see what feels right there. I'm just trying to make sure everything's safe. Alright, listen. Control I will be honest with you, I had a little bit to drink last tonight. A little bit drink? What a good drink? Well, I had some, um, requirements. I'm charged. Okay, uh, how long ago was this? Well, like two or three hours ago. I don't know if I'm drunk, but... Two to three hours ago? Okay. okay. Yeah, I might be That's drunk. I'm feeling dizzy. Alright, well, All right, so now... Just to show you guys, I'm just trying now to see... Now we I really have reasonable suspicion. Yeah, yeah I just want to be honest, because last time it is, it is I was on, it was with the cop, and I got in big trouble. Right, you're refusing, 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 you're Okay. So, uh, I'll tell you here because he already confirmed. Okay. So, he said he had a few shots about two, three hours ago, and his eyes are bloodshot red. Right. And he also said he got beer in the back seat. So, sir, when I asked you if you had anything to drink tonight and you said no, you were lying to me? Maybe. Okay. So, what I'm going to have you do is. Again, I'm gonna ask you, would you like to submit to a field sobriety test? This is completely voluntary. It's up to you, but I, I think you are under the influence of alcohol tonight. Mm -hmm. So yes, I, yeah, I wanna do it. You wanna do it? All right, go ahead and step out for me. And, uh, all right, perfect. Do you have any weapons on you? Um, illegal substances, anything like that? Yeah, I got a combat knife on me. On my All right, where is that? Okay. Your left pocket? Left All right, pocket. go ahead and just uh, go towards your car. Put your hands on the hood. Yeah. I'm just going to pat you down for my safety and yours. And I'm going to take that knife, and all I'm going to do is just set it on the uh, hood of your car. All right. That's for self defense, so you know. Yeah, no worries. I understand, man. Oh, most citizens here are armed, so that's completely fine with me. It's also a very useful tool. Alright, so I got your wallet and cell phone. I'm just going to put that on the car as well. Again, not going through anything, not taking anything, just uh, putting it on the car. Alright, you can go ahead and uh, put your hands down. You're fine. Alright, so what we're going to do is I'm going to have you stare directly into my uh, flashlight. What I'm going to do is I'm going to go left, right, le or I'm going to move my flashlight. You're going to follow with your eyes and your eyes only. Do not move your head at this time. Do you understand these directions? Yep. All right.
Đó. All right. All right. So again, I'm gonna do it one more time. I'm gonna have you do. I'm gonna do, move my flashlight. I'm gonna have you move. Keep your head as still as possible. I'm gonna have you move your eyes and your eyes only. Okay. Okay. All right. Control 208. 208. All right. Start to postal 506 Fine Street. You're right on the corner. Uh, it's going to be for a 911 hang up. No answer on the callback. It's going to be house number Next. 5062. Sorry, I'm ready in the area. Yes, I'll check it out. Oh, All right. Roger Next thing I'm going to have you do is I'm going to have you do a one leg stand. You're going to hold your uh, whichever leg you prefer six inches above the ground. And you're going to count out loud, 1, 1,000, 2, 1,000, 3, 1,000, until I tell you to stop. Do you have any questions? Um, no. All right. Do you have any medical conditions that would cause you to lose your balance, any prosthetic legs, uh, metal hips, anything like that? going to be on scene. No, I only got PTSD. PTSD? Roger, 14, All, right. All right, cool. Sorry to hear that, man. I know it's a big struggle with many people nowadays. So uh, whenever you're ready, go ahead and just start, and then I'll... Uh... Okay. Uh, so you want me to count from 1-1,000 one, one something? Yep, 1-1,000 one, yep. one to 1,000 until I tell you to stop. All right. 1-1,000 one, one to 1,000. 3 one. Oh. oh, okay. Oh, that hurt. Are you okay, sir? Oh. No, I hit my head. Oh, okay. You all right? You like, all right. You like us call you EMS? Head? No, it hurts. You like us call EMS? Yeah, this hurts. Right. I, I got it. I got this. You got it? I got it, yeah. Just Good notify, we're also doing field sobriety tests. Damn, this is strong. Go ahead. <clears throat> notify what? We're also doing field sobriety tests. Okay. I forgot to do that. Uh, can we get EMS to our location? We got times one further to head doing the oh, field like hurts. All right. I'm going to have you do is I'm just going to have you sit down on that park bench over there. What was the nature? Okay. All right. All right. So just okay, relax so for us. Um, on their yep. back and hit their head due to a field body test. Roger. All right. I notified our dispatch that we have uh, to have VMS in right out here. Okay. All right. Are you feeling any nausea? Nausea? Any? Where's your pain? Where's your pain? Uh, sorry. Where are you feeling pain feel currently? At the back of my head. I hit it pretty All right. hard there. All right, I feel I'm lightheaded. That's not what I meant to do. That's Stop. Fine. And pretty dizzy. Perfect. I was just about to do that. Um. Cool. All right, I'm gonna go get my med kit. Okay, I'm bleeding. Yeah. Oh no. I'm bleeding right here on the, on the right of your head. Yeah. This is bad. Good up there. Go ahead. We're gonna have times one, one bleeding to the right, right side of the head. Okay. All right, sir. I'm just going to bandage your head. Make sure, try to see if we can slot that beating, slow it down, something like that. All right. All right. Might feel a little bit of pain as I do it, but just want to make sure that yeah. it's not going to get infected. You're not going to keep bleeding, anything like that. Control 600. 600. You've Linfield Rescue 1 responding with any today at two minutes. 
turn for. Uh, we have EMS in route, sir. They should be here around two to three minutes. They'll be here. Y'all got any water? Uh, yes. I don't right, care. Okay. Thank you. So what's going to happen to me if I come out positive in the breathalyzer test? Because I've done this before, I think. Um, come out positive, then you're going to be charged with driving under an influence. So what we're going to do is uh, we'll breathalyze you once CMS clears you and everything like that. We'll breathalyze you. Depending on that result, um, we'll then do our suspicion. If it comes back um, over the legal limit, which is 0 0.08, we will then take you down to the jail. They will draw your blood. Um, whether it's voluntary or not, it's kind of how the jail works. And uh, then they'll do a blood alcohol concentration from your blood and uh, see what that is compared to what charges would be happening, if that makes any sense. Okay. So we don't really do much on the side of the road because it's the side of the road. We don't have uh, much scientific equipment going on. It's more of uh, things we'd be having at the jail. All right. Uh, so how are you feeling? Are you still feeling okay? Or... No, I still feel like okay. right. I'm dizzy. All right. Go ahead. I was going to add see EMS holding up on scene. All right, cool. EMS is uh, on scene. Roger. Yeah, yeah. You're good to just park right up. Yep, cool. All right, so he just hit his head, and, uh... Right, so EMS is here. They're going to take over the scene. They're going to do a... He was doing field sobriety test. He hit his head and everything like that. Um, oh, he should be okay. We started bleeding a little bit. We applied bandages just to make sure it's everything. We'd like to do a breathalyzer test, and then also, if you have Let's to draw blood, if you have a blood sample Get the now, equipment. and everything like that. It's illegal um, in this state. So yeah. Uh, yeah. Zero point zero eight. Damn. All right, sir. So the EMS is gonna check you out. Um, I think it's paramedic uh, Dave. Yeah, that's that's what his name is. He's a paramedic great guy. Dave. Yep. Oh. Uh. I mean, wait. He's on a rescue. It's firefighter Dave. <laughs> yeah. That yeah. moment when you. Yeah. Don't tell Ryan. <laughs> so uh yep firefighter day is going to check you out and everything like that and uh we'll go from there yep and we'll go from there All right, so bleeding stopped. All right, cool. Are we good to do some more field sobriety tests or take it easy? All right, cool. I don't, I don't want to do any more of those tests. I want a breathalyzer. Okay, we can do that. Is he those good to do that? got me messed yeah. up. All right, if any bleeding starts again, just stop. All right, cool. All right, thank I'll get, you. I'll get the breathalyzer. All right, cool. Thank you. Yep. So I take my phone out. Control, 
Ten hours. Yeah, Ninety nine. Roger, control six hundred status. What's the time? What's What's time it's uh, currently for uh two thirty p.m. in the afternoon. Roger. Oh, it's still raining. Um, currently. All right, I got the buffalizer here. All right, sir. If you want to stand up for me. Okay. All right, so I need you to put the straw in your mouth. And when I tell you the straw, I need you to keep blowing, all right? All right. Just keep blowing fast, steady air until I tell you to stop, okay? You ready? Yep. And go. Uh, keep going. Keep going. Keep going. And stop. Okay. Here we go. Alright, so if you just want to. I say you just want to turn around for me. Huh? Say so if you want to turn around, face the bench. What do you mean turn around? Because as of right now, you're going to be under arrest. You blew a point zero point seven seven. Two away to control. Am I really that drunk? Good. Can I get a 32 started out my know. way? Came in as a 911 hang up. There are signs of squatting and the realtor wants us to make entry and make sure everything's alright inside. Roger, stay by. Alright. Jeez, he's probably needing an uh, ambulance to get out of here. Control 600. Am I still going to have my Six, car? Roger. Could uh, one of your... Uh... Other units break off by chance. I got another call in the county for uh, a 32. Uh, you... You good with us or do you need me? Yeah, I'm, I'm good. You got clear. All right. 10 4, 4 one tank clear. clear. Roger. I, control all right, uh, as of now, so you're going to be. One time, what you got for me? Start to 506 Vine Street. Uh, it's going to be house number 5062, back 208. Uh, one on 911, hang up. Sent for, is there uh, an urgency or a negative? 208, if you can revise. You can roll with traffic. That one. One second, so you can show me in the ground. Roger. All right, so we got sent off of the uh, field sobriety test for backup requests for the sheriff. So we're getting there a little bit quicker than I would normally, just because he's requesting backup. So 506 minus three. One time control, you just show me answer. Hey, what do we got? Roger. Sorry about that, I was typing. <laughs> no, you're fine. So we got a 911 hang up here. Okay. Came out, you know, investigated. Rear window yep. is broken. All right. So just the rear window broken? Rear window broken, rustling inside. House is for sale. I contacted the realtor, and yep. there's been a recent history of squatters in the area, so... Okay. I just wanted so... to get an additional. I'll be going and clear it. Yeah. Which house is it? This one? It's the one across from us. Oh, okay. All right. On you. Six hundred. Go ahead. 
I got time. So we have that system. rear window of which we're gonna make entry through unless the realtor can get out here to unlock it for us. Okay. Roger. Fourteen thirty-five. Um did the realtor say he was in route or they were in route? Uh, I just uh, reached out to them and haven't heard a response back yet. Okay, cool. And like I said, with this being a for sale property, I don't want to um, take down a door unless we absolutely have to. Oh, yeah. No, 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 no. Because um, I haven't seen any signs of motion. So I'd, all I heard was in that rear by that window, some rustling with a broken window. Very well could have been a raccoon or something, but. Oh, yeah, yeah. Um, did you try the doors first? Yes, doors were all locked. Okay. All right, and the windows are all shut too, and locked. Besides that, that one. one rear that's broken. Okay, cool. All right. Yeah, no, I was just on a DUI stop. Oh, nice. Eh. No response from the later. Let's just make entry through that rear window. All right, cool. This is, by the way, roleplay call, as you can tell. Oh, yeah. No, I figured. You're good. I'm going to... Six on your request uh, in tow truck. Just you want to buy the house? The back door and pretend you went through the window. Roger. All right. Well, the guy sheriff's office, you're in here. Make yourself known. Laundry room clear. Yeah, kitchen looks to be clear. So we got hey, a sheriff's office. Hands. Oh, show me your hands. We got one in the closet. I got less lethal. I got less lethal. Control six hundred. Just be advised. Uh, I don't see even CAD. Suspect is showing their hands. La di da di da. Uh, All right, don't turn around for us. My voice. The yep. DOT is a two minute ETA. La di da di da. Backing up. Backing up. And I got you. cuffed. So far. Perfect. If you want a radio, we got out. one. Yep. Affirmative, thank you. One time controls air help. Negative. 10 4, you can show one in custody at our scene. Uh, we'll be investigating further. Oops. Received. I was like, how did we get in? You bought the property. Okay. Because <laughs> I technically bought it for the scene. Yeah, no, it's good. See, this I is just... what people need to do with 911 hang ups. Yes. Oh, that's how it came in a 911 hang up? Yep. Alright. Uh, but I gotta ask Ryan what's on the person? And do they say anything about why they were here? All right, but you're probably looking at charges of breaking and entering at this time. Um, kind of want to see if he's stolen anything, too. Mm -hmm. And he honestly is honestly the best ball. <laughs> we'll see how Ryan takes it, because Ryan's technically the suspect at the same time. Apparently, we also found a female as well. Oh, shit. All right. <laughs> The female is holding a cell phone. Hey, hey, ma'am, yeah. Go ahead and put the cell phone down. Yep. All right, go ahead and turn around. Please wait for me. Perfect. Go ahead and put some towel. You can put the towel on. Yep, I'll, I'll drop my gun. No worries. Put the towel on. Perfect. All right, so go ahead and face away from me. Yep. Go ahead and secure that towel. Perfect. I'm just going to make sure you don't have anything that's... Perfect. All right. What I'm going to do, since you're naked, I'm going to go ahead and walk you over to the bedroom and get some clothes on, and then uh, we're going to go ahead and come with us. All right. All right. Your clothes over here. You left them in the bedroom. Okay. All right. Walking over. Go ahead and uh, get dressed. I'll wait. Let me know when you're done. Perfect. All right. 
I'm going to turn around and wipe the face away from my foresight. Perfect. I'm just going to place you in chess. Can I see a few nears? Perfect. And they're going to double lock these as well. So, then jump on your wrist. Perfect. All right. Go ahead and walk out with me. One ten control, you can show a female in custody as well. Roger. All right. And just face away from me, perfect. I'm just gonna pat you down real quick. Six hundred. You can't deal to your scene. You also can be transported. Roger. All right. One in my car is definitely going for breaking and entering. He also had a switchblade on him. All right. I'm gonna put her in the car. And the female, the phone that she had was traced back to the one that called. Okay. All right, I'm still going to so I'm her starting in. to think right, there's a bigger on. picture here. Yeah, I'm going to tell you what I think in a minute. Hang on, let me just get her in. All right, go ahead and sit. Yep, watch your head. Perfect. All right, I'm not going to buckle you in. We're not going to go anywhere yet. Why can I not fight? There you go. That's not his footwork. Um, Let's come around the corner here. So my thought I'm is... I'm almost thinking an abduction. Uh, that was probably more appropriate than what I was thinking. Trafficking? I was thinking they were having um, fun in the bedroom, and then she wanted to take a shower. They broke in to have fun, if you know what I mean. Okay, so they are dating the two suspects that's my thought interesting yeah okay so i think they broke in to have fun <laughs> and then well i don't want to get banned again um, and then uh she went to take a shower probably either to freshen up before or after mm -hmm. and uh he was waiting in the closet when he heard us yell Liberty County Sheriff's Office. So Yeah. That's that's my thoughts going on right now. Yeah. Or it could be also a domestic situation. We do have signs of abuse on the female. So the male's okay. definitely going. Yeah. It's just whether or not the female's going at this point. I mean, she's probably coming yeah. out with us regardless. Mm -hmm. Just de depends on the capacity. Yes. Is she going to jail? Next question. Or is she going to the sheriff's office or the hospital? Yeah. And then I have one more question for Ryan. That'll be done bothering him. All right. What's the next question? When, so we ask about the female and the male, why they were there and what's the story they give us. Yes. Is there any cameras in the area? I'm not thinking so. Trailer park, probably not, unless That's someone has like thought. a ring doorbell. Well, just being a realtor, the realtor company may have a camera. That's my thought. Bruises all over the left arm and a black eye. How did I not notice that? Wow, I'm blind. All right. So. I'm thinking they broke in. This I'll, I'll ask the dagger to Ryan. All right, so I'm going to go talk to the woman then, get her story, if you want to talk to the man. Yep. All right. All right, ma'am, so, uh, what, what, what happened? I'm just sitting around open the door. All right, what happened? Recently, life has been really hard. We both lost our jobs and had our home taken by the bank. My boyfriend has been getting more aggressive with me lately, and when I came back from the gas station off of Colonial Drive, I was berated and insulted by his drunk ass. I left the room when he tried to approach me, took out my phone, and dialed 911. After that, I ran into the bathroom and locked the doors until you guys showed up. All right. All right, just go ahead and uh, stay in there for me. I'm going to go ahead and close the door. Do you need medical at all? 
You have the right to an attorney. If you cannot afford no. one, one will be right. for cool. you by the court of law. Do you understand these rights? Stand there for which I have read to you. He's for sure going. He's not saying anything. He just wants right, to be here. Are you ready for this mind boggling of a story? Oh boy, what do we got? So she was recent. Their life has been hard. So they've been yep. lost jobs, home was taken by the bank, and everything like that. He's been recently getting more aggressive because of it. She then came back from the gas station off of Colonial, where she was getting gas or going to get food or whatever, yep. and was berated by him and assaulted her. And uh, he was obviously drunk when this all happened. Okay. She backed up as he approached her, and then she got scared and took out her phone, called 911, and uh, ran into the bathroom and locked the door. So, So did she then, like, break the window to get into the house to hide? Yeah, I don't know. I guess uh, that's some more investigating we did. It doesn't matter. At this point, he's going to. Yeah, it's just more of her. I think a hospital. Check her out. Do a you-know-what kit and uh, everything like that. Full workup. Yeah. And then... um, Well, no. We wouldn't really need to do that kit, but it would probably just be best. And then uh, mm -hmm. from there... She can probably either go to the sheriff's office or detectives will talk to her. Or, uh, yeah, I mean, not detectives, we can send her to PD's detectives, but I don't know if we have we'll any detectives. Yep, Jesus, brand's farming traffic right now. Stand by 600. Yeah, but control's also out of channel, so. <sighs> but yeah, no, so she's definitely going to the hospital regardless. Unknown, he might have thrown something while she's run away. It happened so fast. All right. So, through the grapevine, I just don't feel like walking back over there. She said hey, that go ahead. he might have thrown something while she was running away. Okay. And it might have broken the window. So then that's There's attempted a... assault as well. Yeah, yeah. So honestly, I agree with this one. Actually, ten eighty northbound. Oh, for fuck's sake! Are you passing kidding over balance? me? Speeds of around thirty to forty miles an hour. Well, There's no back on it because I'm Roger. not avoiding this for that. No. Right turn east on Oak Valley. See, this is a tough situation because what do we do with the now? female? Because she technically did. Yeah. Trespass into. Roger. But. Your closest units from the city. Okay, um, but it just doesn't make sense. No. Why were they at the house in the first place? We, we haven't gotten that answered. Yeah. But we'll just make up a story on that. Um, <laughs> they, go. they found the uh, keys the under the mat. Let us say that. So we'll add breaking and entering as well. Um, I think Springfield exit. On her or him? On him. Like a weekend get a, Like a... I don't know. Hmm. See, this is tough because in theory you could charge a female breaking and entering too. Yes, but was she willfully doing it? Willingly. See, that's... I don't we know. We all Riverside now. So Stop I think Riverside. my thought is we... Charge him with yeah, everything. He's Roger, bring on Riverside. her to the hospital. Tell her that if yep. she lies or tells the truth, whatever, to the detectives, we can probably yep. further charges on her later on down the road. If if yeah, we find okay. more. So he's getting six hundred. You good? Yeah. Ten four. Okay. Roger, we're continuing south on Riverside. Uh, he's in opposite lanes of traffic at the moment. Uh, he's also blacked out. All right, so I'm going to bring her to the hospital. They'll do it. I'll have detectives pick them up, and we'll see if I can't help out with that pursuit, I guess. I don't know. Good. Oh, my Six God. One zero Continuing zero south on Riverside, back. passing the construction area. 407. All right. I got primary now. We're taking a ride on the Independence Parkway past the hospital. Another pursuit. 
Make it a left onto Park Street. All right, ma'am. I'm just gonna. Park Street. All right, ma'am. I'm just gonna keep the cuffs right on you for now. now. On yeah, they just did. Going. I'm just gonna keep the cuffs on you for now. We'll left. take them off at the hospital, and the detectives are gonna take over from there. All right. All right. Perfect. We're I'm just gonna put it in cab that we're transporting. That's what I I put in cab. I put mine in. So if you want to put yours in. Continuing east on Freedom, he's opposite lanes of travel. You can click transporting button as well. Taking a left on the Klein Street going past DOT. See how it does that? We then can take another left onto Orchard. Take the right onto Independence. Track and Cross Street. Alright, so, uh. A little bit of an interesting. Oh, okay, right. I did not hit that on the Street. So he's going to jail. I'm going to take her to the hospital. Our SPD detectives Correct. are going to be talking. Everything like that. Roger, north on Riverside. Come on, park up. Nurses are going to take her and we'll just give the nurse some like notification. All right, ma'am, go ahead and... Roger, we're going west on Maple now. All right, ma'am, go ahead and step up for me. All right, ma'am, gonna go ahead and just bring you over. I'll get you the cuffs off. Taking a right on the Iron Road, and a left on the Spring Creek Road, 907. Taking another left, back on Maple Street now. Coming back towards that, so. Okay, what's up, pit timer? All right, I'm gonna have you, uh, detectives come out in here, and we're good to go with the doctors. All right, yep, I just talked to you for the night, yeah. So she was abused. Us possibly a getting criminal charges later on. Detectives are determined that, but I'm gonna have detectives come. All right. Am I good to leave or do I need to stay? Stay until the detectives here. All right. Two minutes. All right. Ooh. We good? All right. Thank you. Control 1934. Are you in service? Or I just got on, I just got stationed, what do you need? Uh, we got an active pursuit currently on southbound Highway 55. 10-4, I'll uh, get into my cruiser there too, Mike, let me grab my uh, weapon. Roger, we're now going east on Oak Valley. Now we're just gonna put available. He's off-roading now, going towards the... He's flipping back around, going north on Oak Valley. Taking a right on the Grand Street past the gas station. Taking a left. Going on to Elm Street now. Off-roading it on to Highway 55. 600, take over. We are northbound 55. One time control, am I good to uh, enter pursuit? Are you in service? A firm, air is help. Sure thing. Last known was uh, North on Highway 55. Seven. New dispatch 10280, chase in progress, Gibson Lane 1201. Taking a left now, Spring Creek Road. Taking another left on the northern way by the uh, lake. What's our spike timer at? Uh, nobody started a spike timer, I believe. So far, we can go ahead and. Roger, I'll start one. Continuing south on Highway 55, he's opposite lanes. Six on your 104. Can you take up a prime man to the vehicle? I'm so close, not working. Roger, I'll pass on your left. I am going to wait until he's in. Uh... 
correct uh, lanes. Is it turning southbound 55? Keep it on a highway. He's going northbound, in southbound lanes, on the passing the freedom exit. Now he's making a U turn. Roger. Looks like a good crash route. Roger, we're continuing west on Freedom now. He's still opposite lanes. Taking a left, going past EMS. Are you alright? Cross Street, 300. Yeah, I think, I think I'm good. Taking a right now on okay, Do you Court, want me to stay here, or do you want me to go? Postal 300. No, Come you, to a you stop. can go. He's out of I the car. My, all right. Is my, oh, shit. Is my car okay? I, I yeah, think you're my gonna car is good. Alright. Where's the last... No location. 300. Madison Court. 934 responding. Responding units, three of the line of fire is going to be westbound on Madison Court. Respond from uh, eastbound. That's for copy. All right, are we all here? One, two, uh, three. That's we're point. ready when you are. On YouTube. Ah, uh, this is God, this is God, this is God. This is God, that's fine. Roger. Chief, you okay. want uh, commands or you want me to do it? I don't care, whatever you want. All right. Driver! Walk backwards towards the sound of my voice. Stay facing away from me. No. Driver, listen to my commands. Walk backwards towards Why the should sound I? of my voice. No, I'm not going to do that. You are under arrest at this time. Walk backwards towards the sound of my voice. Do I have one with less lethal? That's for each other, please. Uh, I got less lethal. I got taser. All right. If I knew how to have a less lethal run up on the passenger side of the car. And then try to chase them on the night. All right. I'll, I'll back up. All right. Back okay. up slowly towards the sound of my voice. Keep your hands raised and stay facing away from me. Slower. Slower. Keep coming. Keep coming. Keep coming. Keep coming. Keep coming. Keep coming. Stop. Go down on your knees. <laughs> okay. Okay. That was way farther than I wanted. Ryan, you're cheap. You're good. <clears throat> I got a car. 104, we got 110, 15. I got, I'm ready to secure a car. All right. All right. Man, I ran out of gas in the car. Right, I'm going right. to throw him in your car, Chief. I mean, Colonial. <laughs> uh, all right. Colonel. All right, you ready? Moving up? Yep. Yeah. Back towards square. Right side square. Right side square. Drive right side square. That is clear. One time control, you can go ahead and show the vehicle clear. Unless 104 objects, we can go ahead and look here. Signal 100 is no longer in effect. We see vehicle clear. Uh, signal 100 is no longer in effect. 1505. Great takedown. Out of character, Ryan, you find a lock pick and um, a crowbar. Alright. Uh, can someone help me secure the, or search the car? Uh, I'll help you. Uh, Thank you. Whoops. You guys already secured it though, right? Yeah, it's secure. You guys want to move your cars? Out of the road? Like while we're... Uh, or, or do we no. want to keep blocking the road for a minute? Alright. I'm just gonna go on the other hey, side of the road then. Oh, uh, so. See, okay. 
So um, yeah, oh, okay. So yeah, I heard basically that we got a new uh, flea comp. What's uh, what style car do we have? What? Yeah, uh, cars seems like this. Yeah, cars seems like yeah, thief. Thief. Yeah. Thief. Yeah. Uh, what what type of cars do we have in the uh, fleet now? All I see is a. We just have another. One of four to all, right there. all, all units on scene of that. Uh, uh, all right. Yeah. Now I ended pursuit. Try to go back station. I got a call prior to this pursuit happening about a Grand Theft Auto uh, in uh, the city over by two one three Orchard Boulevard. Uh, the description that was given was a green in color F or green in color uh, Dodge Ram. I'll throw the plate in chat. <clears throat> you, uh, you. Chad, are you? Can, do you have a plate or a uh, registered owners for that vehicle? Affirmative. I uh, I just noted that it was going to be in chat. So All right, so. Uh, User vehicle, vehicle is uh, channel. cleared. Over we found right. his wallet with cash. Did you guys get to play? I didn't get to play on the vehicle. Right. Yeah, it matches. All right, cool. It does. Okay. I'll notify this guy. Two hundred eight to control. Go, Go ahead, two hundred eight. You can show me back in service. Uh, he missed out a lot. Roger, fifteen hundred eight. One time control. Go ahead. If you want to go ahead and connect it to uh, scenes at this time, it's going to be our vehicle. Roger. Uh, did you have a call part of this? Um, no, right when... Said... <clears throat> okay. Yeah. Dispatcher said that right before the uh, pursuit started, um, they had a stolen vehicle. It's a green Dodge Ram. So. And it matches our plate. Like it. Do we have detectives in route? Um, no, we don't have any active at the moment. Okay. Just, I was uh, just going to fill them in on the back end. Okay, cool. Do we have DOT in route? Yep. Cool. cool. Oh, not this is great. Nice. See, see that's what happens when the chief's on the case. He actually does stuff. <laughs> I'm not. A, I'm not surprised when I hear. I'm actually surprised when I hear. Yeah, it's done. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Uh, All right. Um. So you put him in my car. Yep. Yes. Was Colonial. There, was there anything <laughs> on him? Uh, yeah, yeah, crowbar. Okay. Oh, fun. That nope. seems like it matches the entire story. Yep. Did we uh, question him or read him Miranda or anything like that yet? No, not yet. Alright. I'm gonna do it. Yeah, go ahead and make sure to read him Miranda this time. <clears throat> Alright, sir. Let me see, that's fine. Uh, yeah. Thank you. Alright, sir. Uh, Alright, Chief, what do you need from us? Um... If one of you could go to, um, I mean, I could, I could take care of that. Uh, what the? I mean, I'm um, free. I'm on, I'm I was going to have a unit down. head over to the, um, to where this incident occurred. See if they could get it on camera as well for detectives. All right. All right. Uh, wait, where did, where did this happen? Where did this happen? Because we could probably just send the sheriff over. No, I was in the city. Oh. Nineteen thirty-four. If you want to go for it, unless the chief wants to, I, I can. I probably want to get back to the SO. <sighs> I mean, yeah, yeah. Chief, do you want to go for it, or you want me? I mean, he's probably going to be stuck on this vehicle because he's the only jurisdiction in here. So. You're good to go. Thanks. Alright, I'll talk to the dispatch. I'm going to disembark from the call and we're out to the uh, prior to the call. Go ahead. 
show me disengage. Show me off of Mass and Core. What was the postal of the original Grand Theft Auto? Roger, it's going to be the intersection of Orchard Boulevard and Main Street, uh, 213 and 212 area. Uh, the calling party reported uh, it happened at the westbound Orchard Boulevard set of lights. That's for copies. I'll be in route uh, code one. Roger. I guess that's back to them. Um, all right. <sighs> no, I just wanted to keep somebody, uh, okay. figured you had to stay here and I wanted to stay out here for, uh, traffic control at the moment and then, uh, I'll head back to my JD once you're all see it. Okay, yeah, no worries. For control, you show me in the area 212 and 213. Right, I think I'm going to clear off here and try to book them. All right. You know what you're bucking him for? Yeah, evasion, <laughs> stolen vehicle. Um, well, that's so reckless far. driving, the uh, resisting yeah. arrest. Because he didn't comply with us at all until uh, we threatened a taser. So, okay. um, anything so you apparently have his, his apparently his reasoning for stealing the car was because. He needed money. Okay. Uh, Not he to... <laughs> He's planning on reselling a stolen vehicle for money. I mean, people yeah. got to live how they got to live. I'm not going to judge them. But it's not the greatest decision. So. Nope. He should have pulled over and stopped. Mm -hmm. It would have been much easier for him, but... 100%. Well, All right. Anything else, Chief, that you want to add to the charges that we've missed? Uh, he hit you with his vehicle, didn't he? Oh, yeah, he did do that a few times. And then, you know, Was it on purpose? Or or just... Yes. Okay, yeah, so he ran battery back on there. law enforcement? Yeah, okay. Well, I'll get those down. Cool. If there any other charges, you can just email me. Adam Sounds good. Yeah, nice. Uh, thank you. No problem. Thank you. you. I'll let you again. Yep. Six hundred. Six hundred. Five. 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 Did that case, another pursuit, but it was actually a decent one. I actually liked it. I stayed back. There's nothing I can do without a push bar. I didn't really care though. And uh, we handled business as we needed to.